Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be going over my favorite products of October. Everything that I have been grabbing for the most all month long my favorite products of the month so I'm super super excited about this I just love talking about makeup I love talking in general and when it's about makeup it's even better so this is kind of my excuse to chat with you guys let you know what my favorite products have been this last month just catch up on products for the last month so before we get into that please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. It would mean the absolute world to me if you did. But if you wanna see my favorite beauty products of October, then stay tuned for the rest of the video. All right, so I don't have a big, big pile of makeup to talk about. I have like a select few products that I really, really was reaching for this month that I wanted to talk to you guys about. And most of them are not new products. They're just things that either may be a little bit new to me or things that I've just been reaching for a lot more this month, things that have been coming in handy to me this month. So I'm not gonna go in any particular order. I'm just gonna start grabbing things. But the first product that I wanna talk about is these Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta Glow Pads. So I've been using these for a couple weeks now and they are amazing i they're expensive which sucks but they're so worth the money if you ask me like this product is just i don't know how to exp explain it it's like if you struggle with your face being a lot lighter than the rest of your body like me this is such a good product especially if you have sensitive skin and you don't like applying self tanner for your body onto your face I usually do but I also have sensitive skin so sometimes they'll break me out depending on what I'm using this just eliminates that altogether like this product it has skincare in it it has the self tanner in it everything your skin needs and it's still giving you a tan so it's so and the tan that comes out is just beautiful it's super super natural looking you would never think that you're wearing like a product on your face it just literally looks like you were out in the sun even in the winter so this stuff is absolutely amazing i literally can't say enough good things it again it's expensive so it sucks but i personally think it's worth it especially with the sephora sale coming up i feel like this is one of those things that people definitely should be taking advantage of. And there's 20 pads in here. You use them like every two or three days, so they'll probably last like a little over a month, which is not a lot, but they're really, really, really good. So I'm probably gonna buy them again. They've been really good to me. I'm absolutely obsessed. That's all I have to say about those. <laughs> The next product that I want to talk about is the Soft Focus Glow Drops from Rodial or Rodial. I don't know how you say the name, but this is a primer slash serum and it is absolutely amazing. I feel like it gives my face like the perfect amount of hydration slash glow. It has like these little, um, I don't want to say sparkles, but it's like this little glimmer in there and it just like gives your face such a nice like glow to it that i'm obsessed with like you could even wear this without makeup i got these in my boxy charm box for the month and i've literally been using them i kid you not every single day i don't think there's been a day since i've gotten these that i haven't used them because they're so good and i was planning on getting these other drops just like this from sephora i think it was from laniege i think that's how you say it sorry if it's not uh, but yeah i was gonna get those and then these just magically appeared into my boxy charm box exactly when i needed them to and they're absolutely perfect like i seriously think i'm gonna buy this all over again the only thing i don't like about it is that this applicator is a little bit messy but if you can get past the mess it's really awesome so these are really good they smell pretty good too it's not like a strong smell but it's almost kind of like a fruity scent so i do not mind that but yeah really good highly recommend they are a little bit expensive though i think these were like double 
what the Laniege ones were. So I'm gonna have to try the other ones out, see how those work for me. And then if those work better, you're spending half the money. So stay tuned for that. The next product that I wanna talk about is not makeup. Again, it's skincare. I, a lot of these are actually skincare. Clearly I've been liking my skincare lately. <laughs> I didn't even notice that until right now. But this is from Fresh. It is the Black Tea Firming Corset Cream. This stuff is also kind of expensive, but it is worth every single penny, you guys. I cannot stress enough, if you're going to be doing your makeup to go anywhere, you need to put this on before. I'm not even kidding. I feel like when I put this on, it just like really firms and tightens my face and it just gives me that perfect like smooth, silky, beautiful canvas to put my makeup on and I feel like my makeup just goes on so much easier when I put this on. I will say though that this is a very thick cream so I probably would not use this as like an everyday kind of cream. I feel like it would break me out if I did, but I feel like for a night out, like when you're going somewhere, this is what you need. It is so, so bomb, it's amazing. I seriously can't stress enough, you guys need this in your life. Again, the Sephora sale is happening right now. You guys need to try this, you need to get this, and you need to let me know what you think because I am just freaking obsessed. So the next product we're talking about is lashes. So I have experimented with many, many, many lashes over the years, and I've always found that they were either a little bit too much or just not enough. Like there's certain lashes out there that are really big and they're really beautiful, but sometimes I feel like it's a little bit too big for me. I know I can't believe I said that, but yeah, I am more of like a, I like my lashes to be in the middle. Like I want the drama and the volume. I want them to be like noticeable. I want my lashes to be like in your face, you know, but I don't want them to be like poking your eye out if I'm talking to you but I also don't want it to look like I'm not even wearing any lashes. These are the House of Lashes Iconic Light Lashes. These are just like that perfect, perfect balance of, you could definitely still tell I'm wearing lashes, they're definitely dramatic, and they're not, not noticeable, you know? Like they're not crazy big, but they're not teeny tiny either. They're just like that perfect in between. I love how thick the band is. It's not too thick again, but it's also not flimsy. Like it's gonna rip off if you try to pull it. It's just like everything about these is so perfect. And it has like that nice tiny little wing in the uh, end. So it gives a tiny bit of that little cat eye effect too, which I love. I feel like I have like bigger rounder eyes. So sometimes I just really, really want that kind of cat eye effect and this gives me exactly what I need. This paired with the House of Lashes Lash Glue is just such a good combo. Your lashes are not moving, they're not going anywhere. The next product I wanna talk about is not a product, it's products plural. I discovered these early this month, they came out early this month, but these are from the Makeup by Mario collection. So the first product out of those three is the Master Mattes eyeshadow palette. This I've also been using almost every single day this month. Literally every single chance that I've had to put on eyeshadow, I've used this. And it's not even on purpose. This is just literally the first thing I think to reach for when I'm grabbing into my eyeshadow drawer because it has everything I need for mattes. Literally every single color because I am a kind of warm brown tone eyeshadow girl. I just love warm tones. I feel like it suits my skin tone a lot nicer than anything else. All of these colors are perfect. So easy to blend. Just literally everything about this thing. Like you can tell I've used and abused this already because it's <laughs> filthy over here, but it's just so good. I literally, I don't even know what else to say about it. It's just amazing. If I run out of any of the shades in this, I'm probably gonna buy two more, if not one more, because 
I don't think I'm ever gonna stop using this. The next one from Makeup by Mario is the Master Crystal Reflector Highlighter in the color Quartz. This is what it looks like. It's like this really shimmery white. Oh my God, I have literally been talking about this to everybody and nobody probably cares because nobody that I know likes makeup as much as me, but I've literally been talking about this product to everyone that I sit down and talk to because it is so beautiful. I need to swatch this for you guys. If you haven't already, you need to go watch my first impressions video of the Makeup by Mario stuff. I'll link that somewhere in the video for you too so you can check it out. But I really went into detail and I applied it to my actual eye so you can see what it looks like. This is just like a quick little swatch, but look at how pretty and like shiny and just ooh, beautiful this is. That is that. The last product from the Makeup by Mario collection is this eye pencil. Oh my god, hands down the best pencil liner I've ever used in my life. I've used quite a few. Nothing compares to this at all. It's just like the most amazing pencil. It comes off like you barely even have to touch your eye and it's already completely drawn in black. Like you barely need to touch it with the tip of it and it's already there. I feel like you're not wasting as much product with this as you maybe would with some other ones because I've used a few black eyeshadows where you just have to keep like rubbing and rubbing and rubbing for anything to get off onto your eye. And this is just like the total opposite. Like you barely have to tap and it's there. It's amazing. And then this, don't even get me started on this, you guys. This, I think is one of the best creations known to man. <laughs> this thing is just like on another level. Like seriously, if you want like that kind of messy eyeliner look, like that kind of smoked out messy eyeliner, this is the product for you. Like you literally just do a little quick messy job with this. You don't even have to wing it out with this. Literally just draw like I did with this, no wing. And you can do it a lot messier than I did my eyeliner. And then you take this and you just go like this, like flick upwards or I like to just rub back and forth a little bit. And it literally gives you the perfect wing, the perfect kind of smoked out eyeliner look. It's just amazing. Like I've gotten complimented pretty much every single time I've worn this and I've done like that smoky eyeliner look because it looks so beautiful. It looks like you spent an hour on it and it probably takes you like a minute. It's just amazing. The next product I want to talk about is one of my favorite lip glosses ever, I think. And this is the, well, I guess you can't say it's a lip gloss, but that's what I kind of use it as. Sometimes I use it on its own, but mostly when I have like a little liner underneath. But this is the Lip Glow Oil by Dior. Oh my God, this is in the color one pink. I'm wearing it right now on my lips, if you were wondering what was on my lips. And I, every time I wear this and I look in the mirror, I'm like, ooh. Like I know I just recently got my lips done, but I feel like this just really makes them kind of pop out at you and stand out a lot more. I don't know what it does for my lips. Like I have a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk liner. I just lined the outside. I didn't go all the way over my lips and I just put this on in the middle and it just blended everything really beautifully together. And I seriously feel like my lips are just giving you that like effect. Like I really love this stuff. Every single time I wear this, I'm like, who are you? Like, whoa. Last but not least, this is not a product that goes on your face. This is a product that goes on your teeth. So I bought this last year and I went and did, I think it was like the seven or 14 day thing. Like you're supposed to whiten your teeth for seven or 14 days straight and it gets you to like the shade of white that you want your teeth to be. And then you're supposed to do it like once or twice a week, I think, to maintain. 
I was doing it so frequently last year and I would get compliments every single day on how white my teeth were. And then I just got lazy and I stopped doing it and then my teeth got yellow because I drink coffee a lot. So my teeth got yellow, I was not happy. It is the Glow Science. This says Glow Lit, but it's the Glow Science Teeth Whitening. So it comes with this. When you open it, it's the actual teeth whitening mouthpiece. And it comes with a little wire too. And then this thing is what you put around your neck. It's like a little necklace. You press this button and it gives you like this blue light when it turns on. And you plug in that wire from the mouthpiece into here and this is what kind of powers it. So it's like this blue light in your mouth but the actual product itself is so, so amazing. I think I'm on day five right now and I can already see a huge difference in my teeth. Like I was feeling really, really uncomfortable with how yellow I was letting my teeth get. Like I said, I drink a lot of coffee. I need energy. I'm doing things all day, every day. So, I need my coffee and this I feel like has been helping me so so much and I know it works because like I said I used it last year it worked for me and then I just got lazy to use it so this time I'm gonna try really hard to once I'm done with like my 7 or 14 day application thing I'm probably going to be on top of my ass for maintaining because I want my teeth to stay white I don't want to whiten them for seven or 14 days straight and then just let it go like it's not like those crest teeth whitening strips where they make your teeth really sensitive and then you can't eat or drink anything because your teeth hurt so bad this my teeth are insanely sensitive like i have to be very careful when i drink something cold i can't eat sweets on this side of my mouth because my teeth are insanely sensitive and with this like nothing like i can do whatever the hell i want it's totally fine this stuff is just amazing the only thing I will say is that with this you really have to stay on top of charging this thing it comes with like a USB port and you just put it on to charge for I don't really know how long it takes to charge to be honest I think it's a few hours but once it's fully charged I think you could go two days without charging this and then you have to do it again or you'll be in the middle of whitening your teeth and it'll shut off on you, which is kind of frustrating. So that's the only annoying part of it. But other than that, this thing is so perfect. I'm so happy I bought it. But that was the last product that I have for you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Those were like my favorite products of the month that I've been grabbing for non-stop, literally all the time, all day, every day. These are the things that I've been telling everyone to get all month all the things that I have not been able to shut up about all month. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Please, please make sure to comment and let me know which ones of these were your favorites, what you're kind of a little bit more interested in, or if you've tried any of these products, let me know what you think about them. I'm sure we all wanna hear everyone's opinions on what they think of these kinds of products. So make sure to comment. Make sure to give this video a big, 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 big thumbs up please, please, please make sure to share with your friends and please subscribe to my channel as well. If you enjoyed this video, there are going to be tons more like it on my channel. So subscribe, stay tuned, and I'll see you in the next video.